Well, as you make your way through the day, it's a good time to go ahead and thank the people who keep the world working the way it's supposed to. It's National Tradesman Day, and Fox 26's business reporter Tom Ziska says there's an insatiable need for people who know how to work with their hands. Tom. Jonathan, good evening to you. Of the more than 11 million job openings that are open across the country right now, about 40 percent millions of jobs are in the trades. Builders, plumbers, welders, electricians, mechanics. We cannot survive without people like that. And for those interested, there is opportunity to be found. Cody Haley was never interested in a traditional college degree. After a stint in the Army, he found a future learning to work on planes. The airframe, the instruments, the engines, welding, what's ever needed to keep the craft in the air. The world, he says, needs people who can work with their hands. We made things go. If something breaks down, we fix it, or if something goes wrong, we fix it. So people who know how to work with their hands are pretty much keeping everything else in business. Cody's not alone. At the MIAT College of Technology on Houston's north side, there is increasing demand to learn a trade. From aircraft maintenance, welding, heating and air conditioning mechanics, even wind energy technicians, the school anticipates graduating hundreds of students over the coming year who should find easy employment when they're done. The Bureau of Labor Statistics projects hundreds of thousands of job openings for skilled tradespeople, including carpenters, construction workers, electricians and plumbers. A lot of students come and, and, and look to, to do some things that are fun, one. Mm -hmm. uh, two, is going to pay no matter if they have a continuous job or they start their own business. Many students come through, through the doors to, to, to get that freedom. It is just the kind of freedom that Cody Haley is looking forward to living. Pretty good, worked hard, got what I wanted, and now I'm doing what I want, so I enjoy it. What more could you ask for? Demand for these types of jobs is expected to continue as the pandemic and retirement prompts experienced people to move on. So for those who've got six months to maybe 24 months, two years to learn a trade at a cost far below a traditional four-year college, opportunity is waiting. Coming up on the News Edge at 6, there are new employment numbers for Texas. We'll tell you where these jobs fit into the whole picture and where they are indeed growing. For now, watching your money, Tom Ziska, Fox 26 News.